Hello and welcome to the channel. I'm Simon, this is Brett. Hello, and this is Super and he's driving. Um, I think you need to learn how to define what <laughs> words mean. Because no, waving. carrying a toy car does not constitute driving. Okay, now he's driving. <laughs> okay. Oh, now. Being stuck at home is not good for you, is it? I know it's not good for you. Anyway, we're continuing yeah. today with our look at one of my favourite toys from when I was growing up. The micro machines on the fan. Uh, that's a balancing thing. Isn't it? You could do that if you're good. So can do it. Look, if you're good, you could balance ones on each finger like that. Like what? You ain't doing it. I so can't get. It. Cause you ain't doing it right, isn't it? Look at that. All right. You see, that's we're, not. We're that carrying difficult. on with our travel city play sets, and today we're going to take a look at the country farm. Now, with the so country farm, farm, just like the last video we did, because I only just finished recording that one, I haven't got the ramps with me at the moment. I'll have, but when we do the next video, I will make a note and make sure I've got the ramps and everything. And now, you will write it down on a piece of paper, forget you wrote it down on a piece of paper, write it on another piece of paper, forget you wrote it on a second piece of paper, write it down again, find the first piece of paper, and the question. Okay, how many times do I write this on paper? I never do that. No, you don't write it down, that's why. I do write things down. No, you forget about that point. I do write things down. Your mum says to me, write it down. And then two minutes later you go, Oh yeah, it's meant to write something down. What was it? <laughs> no, I don't. I do write it down. But then she moans at me anyway. Yeah, because you didn't write it down. How much would you think this set cost? Hmm, £4.99? No. £8? No. The last one that we showed, What's which was the police station, was from Woolworths and it get off. And it cost four pounds ninety-nine. This one's from Asda. So how much? Two pounds. No. Oh. Three pound ninety nine. Ah, I pound, know. Pound Three pound ninety nine. Yeah, right, cheap. But you got it in this little box. Actually there's two ways you could get these. And they are one of them is this box, and then I have also seen them in blister packs as well. But Oh, the ones that are blister packs, you know, where, um, like that, that's a blister pack. Alright? Is that where they call them blister packs? Because you can get a blister from them. <laughs> um, <laughs> moving on. Why can't they just call it a seafood plastic box? God, that's a lot of words, <laughs> isn't it? God, imagine that if you were in an emergency and you had to do something with you. Well, I can't. You can either tell me the emergency in one word or 26. I'll take 26. Oof. Emergency's passed. Right, so again, <laughs> they fold away nicely in their own little container. So why does it need to be in a seafood plastic box? And then you open them up and everything gets kept neatly inside. And then we answer a question. And then all you've got to do is be able to pull it, pull it together, unlike the last video. Yeah, which didn't he quite failed go miserably. Right. I didn't fail miserably, it just didn't No, he of course he wasn't miserable. What's that? Ugh. And that's quite oh, a book. Well. We'll move that over there a bit. And I'll let your mum clean that up later. That's definitely a bug. So what we've got is we've got a couple of little brown bits, which are your Fields. earth for growing your vegetables and stuff, by the looks of it. Wait, is that the earth? Yeah. So the people who say the earth is flat is correct then? It's an appalling joke. <laughs> I know it is. It's the worst joke ever. Yeah, it is the earth is flat. All right, let me see. <laughs> uh, unfortunately though, I've got no instructions. So, I've got to try and pull it together. Last time I had a load of micro machine stuff that wasn't, um, I didn't have any instructions for was the stuff that I bought from auction. I had to sit there trying to work out what bit was which because when it was in the box, everything was broken up into little pieces. Wait. So I had to work it all out. And thankfully, yeah, that's the next piece. Um, yeah, but I think, hang on. 
because this goes here. Then there's a red field here. Wait, why is it red? I don't know, wait. Why put this bit here? Then right. this bit here. And then that here. goes. But I think, I think you've got to do that that way around. Okay. Right. And then we've got this, which goes like this on this. But why is that piece red? Are we doing this correct? No, you're not. You're doing it the wrong way around. No, I didn't. Here it is, look, the cockles at the front. Maybe it is. So you put that out. <laughs> you put that there. And then this bit goes... Well, where do you want your cock to look? There you go. Well, that way. This is weird, because on the box here, it shows this going up through that way. But the holes are this way. That's weird. Oh well. Wait, he Wait. goes. No, 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 no. No, he does not go anywhere. He does. Why don't you do it your way then? It has to be connected first. Mm -hmm. And then you need to fud the table. Yeah. It's called thump. Well, you fudded you it. You thump the table. Please learn proper English. Okay, what's the difference Have between Have you got the right bits? Yes, I've got the right bits. Are you sure? Because I've got a flat bit that sticks out and it's supposed to be... The flat bit's supposed to stick in. Maybe now it's the right bits, which just means I have to take up the entire thing. To take out one piece, pass no, that piece. No, I don't want that bit. This bit is for there. So he goes there, look. But right. give me that end bit. Get off. That's that long piece. Mm. That's better. Right. Pass. This is mine. That's Wait. yours. That's yours. Yay. Does it go detailed facing out or detailed facing facing in? I ain't got enough holes here. What's going on? I don't know. Wait, this can't be right. This isn't right at all. No, well, that's mine. What are you doing? Stop nicking my bit. That's better. Uh, of course, on this channel, we are fully professional at putting things together. Well, I am, and you're not. I had it right the first time, and then you sold a piece. I did not touch your piss at all. <laughs> I, said... I mean, peace. <laughs> I messed up my joke. <laughs> 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 Yeah, put the vegetable back in. <laughs> so there we go. Stop being oh, nice. the monetizer. We can't even get monetizer. What are you talking about monetizing for? Okay. Stop being when we get the one. When we get monetized, stop being the monetizer. Do you know what would be quicker? Uh, Me winning the lottery. What then? You not swimming? I tell you what. I'll race it. Right. I'll race it. I'll see if I can win the lottery before we ever get to a monetization place. Well, maybe someone can help that out by I subscribing. Yeah. yeah, good luck. Do you want to grab the turntable? Fine. So we're going to go get it. We've got this lovely bit of road here that goes underneath the... Would that be a barn? It's a barn. All right. That barn. Drive through, then. And then a little off-road here that could go to the police station. Well, I don't know. Turn it slowly. And then we'll tilt it up so that people can see the little piggies. Well, they are. What do you think now? They are rocks. Pink rocks. <laughs> <laughs> Old MacDonald had a farm. Okay, so I say white dots then. Rocks. With a with a sniff, sniff here, <laughs> just sniff there. No, with a nothing, because rocks don't do a lot, do they? <laughs> like I said, though. Wait, look. Talk wait. About. Oh no, they're poor, they're poor pigs then. So you've got your little cockle here at the top. And then you've got your pig sty with a bit of um, 
hay in the top there. This is weird though, because the box does show that the other way around. It shows it going this way, but the holes go the opposite way. It can't have it both ways. Funny. So, what do you think of these toys? Do you think they're good? Yep, although i got one problem. What? First of all, that paw trough. Yeah, you got a pole gun through it. Secondly... It'd leak. What is that? What? They're like little white dots. Kind of like pebbles. They're birds. They're like chickens pebbles. or something. They're more like pebbles, though. Oh, Gordon Bennett. What's this? Rock and pebble day, is it? Yeah. Anyway, if you like this and you want to see... <laughs> and you want to see some more... Kind of been a bit touched up there. <laughs> what? Please uh, subscribe to the channel. We'll be doing some more of these Travel City ones. <laughs> there is some stuff that's come out of an auction that I'll be showing. There's also a car crash. The rest of my collection of micro machines. We're also going to be looking at some other toys as well, from what I've got. And if you have been watching the channel, you'd see that we did some Batmobiles. I will be going back to them. Uh, it's just that some of them have been moved around. So I've got to find out where they've been put to because um, we've had a lot of stuff going on recently. So uh, thank you very much for watching. Watch that car crash. And we'll see you next time. Bye bye. Bye. Things waving. And guess what he's about to do? What? He's going to destroy his farm. No thanks. Get lost. Whee! <laughs>